Texas Adventures with Brexton. Be sure to subscribe. Idgets on the move. Every city has one. Oh my words. Bone Appetite, Texas. Mmm, doggy. Mmm, yummy. We're about to get on the highway. Let's start our little adventure here. Saw one idget already. Let's see if you see any more. We're getting on to the 635 off of Centerville Road. Ferguson on one side, Centerville in the Garland area. So I guess we've actually been on the Ferguson side. Well, on our way to town Hope the picture's coming out pretty good. We'll see. All this construction going on. Looks like they got this big old space over here on the right. They could have used the highway a little bit over there, I think, but they didn't. Uh, I'm using my blinker. So, I just want to kind of explain that I do every video on my engines on the moon. Boom. All right, this little stick on the left-hand side of your steering wheel, behind it, it's called a blinker. Up, you turn right. Push it down, you turn left. Simple little object. Oh my word! What can't get you? Can't you get out of that blinker? It might save some lives or save save some idiots from doing stupid things. Had a digit come in behind me. He went from the left hand all the way over to the right hand lane. No blinker. And plus, this is a 50 mile an hour speed zone. Right here, this is all in construction. But what are people doing going past me right now at 150? They're going 60, 65, 70. I think here comes a 70 mile an hour one right now. Here he comes. Ooh, is he comes. Does he use a blinker? Is he? Is he? Is he? like he wants to use a blinker. Well, uh, he didn't like he wants to stay behind that truck, I guess. Yeah, there's an out-of-counter idiot. He hasn't used, he hasn't done the blinker thing yet, we'll see. Yeah, we're going to head over here to town each mile. I'll cut it off, and then I'll start it back up after I do my mile walking. I might do a little video of mile walking again. It's actually pretty fun doing that. Yeah. Got a little video problems today on my camera, but it seems to be doing good right now. The heat has messed up the stick, and it's made it kind of uh, heated it up a little bit. It's supposed to, I guess, I should have just not left it in the window all summer. In about 39 days, or over 100 degree temperature, it's kind of melted a little bit. So whenever I put the camera on there camera wants to angle itself all the way down. So I try to put it behind the rear view mirror to see what that would do. So we'll see. This may not be a video that I'll be able to post. We'll have to check it out. But, ooh, see, I'm going, I'm going a little over 50. That guy's going about 70. That's crazy. Not so bad today. The traffic is too bad. How you feel, Steve Chapman? Doing fine. Don't Mr. call me. Thank you. Go ahead, Mr. Collins. Thank you. That's better. He's freaking. Well, here's our town east exit. I know it snuck up on me. Ooh, doggy, that's town east exit snuck up on me. They moved it further back. Stay up there. Let's see if that'll work. Sorry about that, guys. I may have to edit a lot on this video. <laughs> well, they got the van stand up the, over up in the water. Well, yeah, the North Mesquite High School bandstand is up where the director can stand up there and direct the band to do everything right on the field. So, yeah. Now we're about to make a left here on Town East Boulevard. 
head over here to the mall. Still one of the shopping centers here. It hasn't been doing very good lately in sales, I hear. Counties has been kind of hurting. They're trying to find a lender. So if you're a lender watching this video and you want to purchase something at County's Mall, like the whole mall, help out with it, come on. We don't want to lose this mall. It's actually a pretty nice indoor mall. So help us out, fellas. Come down again. Maybe that'll do it. Let's see. Let's try that. It's not having any luck. Oh, there we go. There's Gandhi. Gandhi. American style. <laughs> yeah, that's Gandhi. Just missing his road. Scott does that sometimes. But Scott on tape, good friend of mine. He does his video, which I won't copy. But he'll pick out people every once in a while. Every once in a while, I'll pick out somebody that I think they look like a famous person. <laughs> see that cloud over there? If y'all can see that? Those are some thunderheads. We might get those. Ah, it would be nice to come over here. Got a nice little gully washer right here. Somewhere out in East Texas again. Well, I'd sure like to have been underneath that. You know me, like I told you in the beginning of the video. I am going. If it rains, I'm going out there in my boxer shorts. That's it. And run around that front yard. Because I'm here. Yep. Why, why would he be an idiot? Oh, yep, he's an idiot. He picked it out. He didn't use a blinker to change lanes. Let's go this way. There we go. That's the best shot to get to the mall. Now you can see the mall a little bit if you keep the stupid camera up. Dang it. Yeah, it's a good mall. It's been around for a while. I just hate to see it closed. Here's our old Sears right here. It's gone. We're hearing main event mic in this video because I'm about to oh, strangle this phone. So, yep, about to strangle this phone. Sorry about all the movement, folks. But uh, I'm going to end this video anyway. So, we get our little walk from here to the mall. It's not that far. But, all right. About to end this video. I might add a little more right at the end after we leave and head back to the house. But I'll uh, talk to y'all a little bit. Had a few edges on the road. We'll do a little bit more traveling to get some more. I gotta go to the bank still and put my check in the bank. So I'll talk to you later. And don't forget, just in case this is the end of the video, the thing I like to always end my videos in don't let the road hit you in the butt. Bye!